Good morning. Today's lesson is 3.10. Problem solve. The coordinate planes. Our essential question, how can you use strategy to draw a diagram to help you solve a problem on the coordinate plane? Let's unlock the problem. An artist using an illustration program. The problem uses a coordinate plane with the origin 0, 0, located at the center of the computer screen. The artist draws a dinosaur <clears throat> centered on the point 4, 6. Then she moves it 10 units to the left and 12 units down. What ordered pair represents the dinosaur's new location? Use the graphic organizer to help you solve the problem. What do I need to find? Well, I need to find the ordered pair for the dinosaur's new location. What information do I need to use? Well, the dinosaur started at point four, six, and then the artist moved it 10 units to the left and then 12 units down. How will I use this information? <clears throat> well, I can draw a diagram to graph the information on a coordinate plane. So I'm going to start by graphing and labeling the point. Okay, and remember my point was 4, 6. 4, 6. So I'm going to go over to 4, and then I'm going to go up to 6. So this is my start. From this point, I'm going to count Remember, it's 10 units to the left, so let's do that. So we're going to go 1, 2, actually these are by 2's, aren't they? So 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 units to the left right here. Then I'm going to count 12 units down. So again, we're counting by 2's because these are labeled in 2's. So 2, 4, 6, 8. 10, 12. So I'm going to put my point right there. So my dinosaur's new location is right here, right? So now let's figure out what this one is. Well, I go over to negative 6. There's negative 6. And then I go down to negative 6. So my new location coordinates is going to be negative 6, negative 6. The dinosaur's new location is going to be negative 6, negative 6. Let's try another problem. Tyrone and Kyra both walked home from school. Kyra walks four blocks east and three blocks south to get home. Tyrone lives, on, lives three blocks west and three blocks south of the school. How far apart are Tyrone and Kyra's home? Use the graphic organizer to help you solve the problem. Let's read the problem. First of all, what do I need to find? Well, I need to find the distance from Tyrone's home to Kyra's home. What information can I use? Well, I can use the information that Tyrone and Kyra start at the same point. Kyra walks four blocks east and three blocks south. Tyron walks three blocks west and three blocks south. How will I use the information? Well, I can use the coordinate plane with the school at the origin. I can trace each student's walk home and mark where his or her home is. Then I can determine the distance between their homes. So let's map out if Chiron starts at the same point. So remember, Kyra walks four blocks east. So she's going to walk four blocks east, one, two, three, four blocks east, and three blocks south. One, two, three. So there's Kyra. And then Tyrone, he walks three blocks west, one, two, three, and three blocks south. One, two, three. So this is Tyrone's home, and that's Kyra's home. So if I'm going to find out how many blocks apart they are, I can just simply count. One, two, three, four five, six, seven. So it's seven blocks from Tyrone's house to Kyra's house. Sorry, my screen got messed up a little bit up here, but hopefully you have those answers down already. So use the approximate tools. Describe the advantage of using a coordinate plane to solve the problem like the one above. Well, using the coordinate plane helps you see the relationships between the locations and describes in the problem. It allows you to plan and solve the problem. One of the houses was four blocks east of the school and one of the houses was three blocks west of the school. So it makes sense that the houses are seven blocks from each other. I'd like you to do the rest of the problems on your own or with a partner. You can always use me. Good luck.